is a quick video to explain to you guys why I don't have more tarot reading videos up on my website. Um, I know that these have been very popular with you guys. I love that you love them so much. I really enjoy the feedback and I'm grateful that I am able to help you kind of navigate weird situations or explain things that other people um, haven't really been doing a good job on. Um, so that really is something uh, that I appreciate and I'm so glad that you enjoy them. However, a lot of people are like, well, why don't you just do more? We want more tarot. Um, and while that's great, uh, my thing is, is I'm really about more quality over quantity. I'm not really interested in making just a ton of videos just to slap stuff up here and get the algorithm going and all that sort of stuff. My goal is to actually make things that are going to be helpful for you um, and introspective and that will really help you learn and grow. So that's why I, I, when I make videos, I really try to make stuff about subjects that maybe people aren't talking about or unique situations or different things. However, if there's anything that I'm not talking about that you think would be helpful to you, please reach out, send me a message, get a hold of me and let me know. And I'd be more than happy to make a video for you on it if it's something that's within my area of expertise, whether it's in tarot or whether it's more magic or, you know, shadow work or self-connection or any of those things. Um, you know, I really am here to make what you guys want to see. Um, as for the tarot videos, if you're somebody that's watching this and just really hoping for more, like, oh, I want more, where's the more? Um, I really want to impress to you that it's important to, if when you're doing tarot, tarot is more than just flipping the cards and putting them down. It really is. What I have found through my personal experiences is, is that, you know, tarot is really about um, having a good understanding of yourself, uh, knowing how to connect with other people really well, doing your own personal shadow work, and also having knowledge in other areas that you can incorporate into your readings. You know, for example, I incorporate numerology into my readings. Um, I incorporate different astrological events because sometimes it explains what's happening with different, you know, with people. It's how things are affecting stuff. Um, you know, the numerology is the same. That can really affect people and what's going on in their day-to-day -day lives. Um, you know, I'm also well-versed. I might offer, you know, magic or rituals or other things to help, you know, empower you to get past these roadblocks and these things that the cards are bringing up for us, um, whether that's self-growth work, different techniques, stuff like that. So for me, when I'm watching, you know, if I'm learning tarot, that is something that I would suggest to you as well. Look at some of these other areas um, that are interesting to you and see how you can overlay that um, into your readings because the reality of it is tarot is not really just tarot. It's not. Um, you have so much more to offer than that. Um, now that's not to say that you have to, and you should, but I think, um, there's a natural progression that will happen with your tarot readings over time, um, because you are a spiritual person and you will be learning and growing in that arena as well. So as you do that, your gifts will expand, your intuition will expand, you know, look for stuff on how to develop your intuitive senses, because that's going to help you access even more information than me just telling you how to read a sideways tarot card, right? You're going to be getting information from all these different areas from spirit that will help you give an even better reading than the one you're already doing. So I think it's really important too to have a wide um, like birth of study, area of study uh, when you're reading tarot because you'll never know which direction things are kind of going to go in that reading or how you might be able to be of service. So um, those are just some things that I really wanted to share with you um, if, if this is, uh, if you're just sitting here like, I want more tarot readings, or I want more information, where should I go? What should I do? Um, that's just a recommendation that I would have that will help you as a spiritual person, that will help you as a tarot reader, that will help you as a human being, right? Just trying to make your way through life. So um, hopefully that was helpful, it gives you a little food for thought, different perspective on things, and maybe starts, you know, getting you excited or getting things firing on all cylinders of like, hey, I could get creative this way, or I want to do this, or I want to look at this. Um, sometimes it just takes a little spark of inspiration too to help, um, you know, get you a little bit farther down your path. So if you have any questions or suggestions or anything else for stuff you'd like to see, as always, please let me know. Otherwise, until next time, thank you so much for watching and I hope you have a beautiful day.